Hello, here we are at um, Game Force. Game Force is out in a, on South Chambers Road in Aurora, Colorado. They have a GameForce.biz website. That's Gameforce, G-A-M-E-F-O-R-C-E, dot biz. Anyways, we're looking at uh, the Sega 3D glasses. I thought this would be appropriate considering that 3D's been in the news a lot lately. They're actually selling these ones for $100. Um, they work with the Master System with the Sega Power Base. It says, a view from the inside. Are you ready to make contact with the inner dimension? If so, put on a pair of Sega's 3D glasses and literally see the whole picture. The Sega 3D glasses transfer your vision into your game's compelling screen, where hundreds of vibrant colors greet your eyes and graphics come alive. But beware, they're coming from all sides now that you're on the inside. Sega's matched high-speed liquid crystal shutter technology with VHD compatibility for a high-tech instrument that won't interfere with your own glasses. To operate, see your player's handbook that accompanies every three-dimensional mega cartridge. They look a little bit like this. We're going to go ahead and actually open this box and take a look. Sega 3D glasses. Oh, I have to put that down for a moment. There we go. On the top here, we have the Sega 3D glasses instructions with, of course, the actual warnings and stuff, you know, don't expose glasses, etc. Insert 3D Mega cartridge. Warranty. This place sells a lot of interesting stuff. This is the glasses input. It's the 3D adapter. I'm not completely sure where that plugs in. And, of course, the cables and the glasses themselves. If we look at the um, glasses themselves, they're in a little plastic bag, which we're going to open up a little. What these seem to do is they look, they work a little bit like the 3D shutter glasses that most people will be buying for their PlayStation 3s and thinking they're ahead of technology. Um, essentially how shutter glasses work is, um, is they, um, they flicker along with whatever inputs are being put through the um, system. Like one side will be blacked out and the other side will be clear. They flicker along in time with the um, with the images on the screen, which kind of flicker in and out. It's kind of like a, if you're opening and closing Venetian blinds really, really quickly. Anyways, this is uh, these are the glasses. You can see into the third dimension. But uh, yeah, they're they look like little wraparounds that you would put over you would buy over at Walmart to go over your glasses so you can drive in traffic. But I would not suggest driving in traffic with these. We're not actually going to check and see how they how they work with this system because uh, that would be kind of a pain to pain to uh, set up. But in order to set them up, you'd need the glasses, and then you'd need this, which you'd plug in. I'm expecting to see something similar with the PlayStation 3, where they expect you to plug it into a box, then plug it into your TV, and plug these into a box, similar to what we have now. Kind of amusing that technology hasn't really changed over these years. But yeah, these are the Sega 3D glasses. Um, if for some reason you want to buy these ones, and you actually have the cartridges, they're actually available for, for, um, at Game Force. That's uh, Game Force, game, GameForce.biz, at South Chambers Road, Aurora, Colorado. Kind of crazy, really. But yes, that's the Sega 3D glasses.